all right well like i took this one personality test and it, it tells me i'm an introvert and that's just what i am and because i'm an introvert i can't do extroverted things Sub, this is David, and today I want to talk to you about the fixed mindset versus the growth mindset. What is a fixed mindset? Fixed mindset is pretty much having a victim mindset. Telling yourself that I can't do this because society has labeled me as something. Or I can't do this because I'm an introvert. I can't do this because I'm shy. I can't do this because I haven't... It's like pretty much... Um, creating limiting beliefs for yourself creating limiting beliefs for yourself and using labels as an excuse using labels as, as an excuse so let me give you some examples of a fixed mindset so a fixed mindset could be like all right well like i took this one personality test and it, it tells me i'm an introvert and that's just what i am and because i'm an introvert i can't do extroverted things you see how this can become a very limiting type of mindset? It won't allow you to be more extroverted. It won't allow you to grow more confidence. And here's the thing, like I, I, am, I was a super introvert. I used to be the shyest kid in the world, right? But if I was stuck in that fixed mindset of telling myself I can't go out there, I can't do public speaking, I can't speak in front of a video camera because I'm introverted. Introverted people don't do that, right? If I told myself that, then I would not be doing this, you know? I would not have grown so much more confident. I would not have been able to socialize with more people and to grow, you know, those skills of conversation. I would not have been able to do that if I was stuck in a fixed mindset. And so society, what they try to do is like, they try to put all these labels onto us. Like you are shy or introverted, you, um, they give us like letters, right? They, you have PTSD, you have ADHD, you're not supposed to do that. And then what most people do is they take these labels and they make it as an excuse to not work on themselves pretty much. They're, they're taking like an excuse of, oh, I have ADHD, I can't focus. And, and they become a victim, right? They become a victim of, of that label instead of working on themselves, instead of saying, you know what? I don't care if, they, I, if anybody tells me I have ADHD, I'm, I'm still gonna be able to, or I'm still going to learn how to focus better. And you definitely can learn how to focus better. And I, I used to have the worst focus, you know, I used to be distracted everywhere. But now after like, you know, years of just of being, training myself to focus more and more, especially through meditation and, and uh, working on like long projects, I am a different person now <laughs> with a different pretty much mindset and, and uh, like psychology and then I'm, I'm pretty sure a different brain than I was like 10 years ago for example. So all this stuff they can be learned. So this is known as the growth mindset. Knowing that you can grow, you can learn, you can learn anything, you can get better at any skill, any skill you can get better at. There's no there's no gene for like introversion, okay? There's no no gene for like, okay, this person can focus better than this person. There, those things don't exist, okay? These things can be learned. You just have to allow yourself to learn, okay? You have to get into that mindset of the growth mindset and remove that limiting belief of being a victim. All right, so, uh, that's just what I had for, for this video. And if you want to, if you want help on removing those limiting beliefs or removing those subconscious blocks of like, you know, you want to escape out of like the, the cycles, the deadly cycles of like not being able to get past a certain ceiling and just sabotaging your work, then I do have a program that helps people to absolutely transform from a very deep psychological level. You know, we're really removing a lot of those subconscious blocks and, and getting you to transform your, your pretty much like your mindset and your psychology from like the deepest level possible. So if you want to apply for a coaching program, you can click the link down below. And the first coaching session is, is free, you know, absolutely free. 
and of course um, you do have to qualify for, for the coaching sessions but you can you can try to apply so click the link down below or the link in the bio and I hope I can I can we can start changing the life start transforming the life world. so that's it for this video I hope you found value out of this one and I'll see you in the next one